were in the church of Santa Maria del Carmine in a chapel within the church, which is called the Brancacci Chapel. It is completely filled with fresco and also a temper painting. And on the left, in the upper register, is a painting by Masaccio. It's actually two paintings. One is the expulsion from Eden, and to its right is a much larger painting, the tribute money. And the chapel is filled with people here to see Masaccio's great masterpiece. Masaccio painted a few of the scenes here of the life of St. Peter, but the rest of the chapel was largely painted by one of his contemporaries, Masolino. But it's Masaccio who we are here to see. So let's talk about the tribute money first. It's a pretty complicated scene. It's a story from the New Testament that tells of Christ being confronted by a tax collector who works for Rome. And the problem is that Christ has renounced all worldly possessions. He doesn't have any money to pay. Right. Christ and the apostles have no money to pay the tax collector, who we see here in the center in orange with his back to us. And with a short skirt, unlike the other figures which were more fully clothed. And Christ and the apostles have halos, and we can identify the tax collector because he doesn't have a halo. And and he's making gestures demanding money. The tax collector is standing in the lovely contrapposto. Some art historians have suggested that that may have been painted from a Roman sculpture. The contrapposto could also have come from Donatello. Absolutely. Christ directs St. Peter to go get money to pay the tax collector from the Sea of Galilee, from the mouth of a fish. So Christ performs a miracle. The apostles will indeed be able to pay the tax collector because the money will appear in the mouth of a fish that we see St. Peter getting on the far left. And then on the far right, we see St. Peter paying the tax collector. So we've got three different moments of time. In the New Testament, Christ says, render unto Caesar what is Caesar's, render unto God what is God's. In a sense, saying, Caesar minted this money, we can give it back to him. It's not important. What's important is the soul. There is a really specific Florentine context for this. The Florentine government had just initiated a new tax called the Catasto, which was an income tax. I think this was seen by the Florentines as an idea that... Just to the left of Masaccio's great painting, The Tribute Money, is another painting by Masaccio, The Expulsion from Eden. The frescoes in this chapel all tell the story of the life of St. Peter, except for the expulsion. We could ask, what is the expulsion doing here? Yes. This is the story of Adam and Eve being expelled from the Garden of Eden. They've eaten the forbidden fruit from the Tree of Knowledge, and God has discovered that transgression and has banished them from Eden, and we see a foreshortened angel. 